and stop. And breathing. And give us another fright. And stop and breathing. And forwards, walking. <laughs> Who's doing that? That's, is that you? <laughs> That's nice. That's what it needs because at the moment it's too up there. It needs like a. Well, I've worked with the designer of the puppets, a uh, South African artist called Roger Titley, since 2019. And he designs all sorts of animals, usually African animals, giraffes, elephants lions, uh, all sorts in this style, which is a combination of this very lightweight foam called polyethylene uh, and these straps that are worn by people. And so they carry the puppet. In a way, it's not really a puppet anymore. He calls them creatures because they're sort of partly puppets. They're partly costume. And they carry it on their back and they manipulate it from inside. Yeah, I'm starting to be through spending a lot of time on YouTube looking. I mean, the, the world of horses, it's, like a, it's a whole universe, you know, and there are people that are real experts in it and they're so complicated. The, there's so much emotional language that they have with their breath, with their ears, with their eyes, with their legs and how they can shake with their tail is a huge emotional indicator. And it's just a pleasure to play with that and be able to recreate it on something that is essentially a lump of plastic. Yeah, I think the main, the main difficulty is there's, there's three actors with three brains and they have to give the illusion that there's one horse with one brain. But they, they need to do that without communicating verbally between themselves. And so we do a lot of exercises where they work as a team begin to build this nonverbal communication between themselves. So it can be, you know, in months time, once they've performed and they've been doing this every day, the smallest movement will ripple through the horse so that right at the back, he can feel just one ear moving and can respond to it appropriately. Well, that's ideally. Farinelli and Karelis, no 16. September. Regisors, Viestur Skarish.